family's three-legged dog goes missing. Then they get a distressing message. Having a runaway animal is one of the worst gut punches a pet owner can suffer. But most people still clutch to that sliver of hope that they'll fall into the small percentage of people who find their furry friends. Sadly, the reality is that most people never get answers about where their pets disappear to. But for one Missouri man, his lost dog story unfolded in a way that was anything but typical. In February 2020, right before the COVID-19 pandemic locked down the world, Dylan Summers suffered an incredible loss. When the Bourbon, Missouri resident went out in his backyard to call his dog Athena, she didn't come running with her tail wagging as usual. Instead, she was nowhere to be found. Panic set in. Dylan scoured the yard looking for her and subsequently the rest of the neighborhood. Fortunately, the one thing he could count on was that his dog was instantly identifiable. Athena, a beautiful brindle dog, had one key feature that Dylan hoped would help bring her home. She had three legs. A year prior, Athena suffered having her leg amputated. It was a tough decision that weighed heavily on Dylan as he tried to do what was best for his pet after she was hit by a car. He thought that overcoming that accident had put their worst days behind them, and he was sorely mistaken. At the time of her disappearance, Athena was still on medication as part of her recovery plan, which added another layer of worry to Dylan's plate. The idea of his dog suffering without proper care on top of the confusion of not understanding what was happening to her was almost too much to bear. Dylan acted fast and moments after discovering Athena vanished. He searched the area tirelessly without luck. He laid his hopes in attempting to locate her via online postings, though as he told the St. Louis news station, KTVI, Fox 2, no one came forward. I had suspicions that she was stolen, but I couldn't confirm it. I was so worried about her, Dylan told the local news. It seemed suspicious that Athena vanished from the backyard without a trace when she had no problem staying put before. Without any leads on where she disappeared to, the odds of finding her looked slim. Heartbroken, Dylan wasn't sure he'd ever see Athena again, so he resolved that the best thing he could do was provide a good home to another animal in need. After ten long months without a dog in his life, he felt ready to adopt again. Dylan found himself scrolling through the Gateway Pet Guardians website, a rescue group located about an hour away. There he saw a cute little face that stopped him in his tracks. Without pausing to think, he grabbed his phone, dialed up the number listed on the page, and hoped desperately that someone would answer. After painstakingly waiting through several rings that seemed to last hours, Dylan reached a voicemail. He blurted out everything he could, hoping that he wasn't too late. The face looking back at him from the webpage was unmistakably Athena's. An hour away, program director Alicia Vianello didn't notice her missed call. In those moments, Dylan's mind raced. Had Athena already been adopted? Was there a chance that he was wrong? Could this be a different, brindle, three-legged dog? He had no choice but to wait for answers. Thankfully, Vianello noticed shortly after as she told KTVI Fox 2, it was about 9 p.m. on the night of December 30th, and I just happened to check my voicemail before bed, and there was a call from Dylan stating that we had his dog. I called him back immediately and was so happy to learn that the dog that we had named Miss Ato was actually his missing dog, Athena. When Athena was first picked up by shelter workers from a neglectful property with several other dogs, workers felt that she really stuck out from the pack. While all the other dogs showed signs of extreme neglect, Athena had undergone an amputation operation and received other surgical work to her tail. That suggested someone out there cared for her. Not only did the surgical evidence suggest the dog had previous caregivers, but she was also spayed and pretty healthy. For some reason, this particular dog that showed signs of being loved had ended up on the property of a person in serious legal trouble that was seized by police. Clearly, there was more to her story. Program director Alicia Vianello told KTVI Fox 2, Everyone involved in a rescue had been so puzzled as to how a dog who was not only spayed but was also healthy and had received a life-saving surgery was on the property with other dogs who seemed likely to have never received veterinary care. When she heard Dylan's message, all the pieces fit together. Vianello reached out to the foster family that was caring for Miss Atto 
to update them on the situation. Within 48 hours, they made a plan for Dylan Summers to meet with the dog at the Gateway Pet Guardians facility to find out once and for all if she was indeed his pet, Athena. After months of grieving for his beloved pet and resigning himself to never seeing her again, Dylan Summers was beyond excited to meet the dog he knew beyond a shadow of a doubt was his pup, Athena. The moment they laid eyes on each other, everyone else knew, too, that she was his long-lost canine companion. I'm so happy to hear that she was safe and doing well, and being reunited with her was incredible, Dylan told KTVI Fox 2. She's already settled back in at home, and it's like she never left. I'm so appreciative of Gateway Pet Guardians for getting her back to me. Despite the odds, they'd become one of the success stories. It was pure chance that Dylan had begun to search for a new pet during the time frame that Athena was listed on the rescue site, and another coincidence that he'd found the right organization when it was an hour away from where he lived. The stars aligned just right so to get the man and his best friend back together. For Dylan and most other pet owners, losing a pet is the same as losing a member of the family. That means no matter the circumstances, giving up the search or hope of a reunion simply isn't an option. For one family in particular, when their dog went missing, they got creative in a way that only dog lovers will appreciate. Please feel free to share this with your friends.